Welcome back everyone, Nick and Lex here. Thank you so much for joining me today to a new episode of Music with Nick. Super excited, we got some Richard Thompson marathon today. I'm super stoked because it's all live videos. And um, uh, yeah, I wanted to thank JK for pulling this together, for making the video happen, for sponsoring the marathon. Um, uh, yeah, without further ado, let's get into the songs that we're going to be watching today. Um, this is an, a very interesting list, and I got all the links already pulled up, so we're ready to go. So first one is going to, um, this is a little introduction here uh, by uh, JK. It says, Richard Thompson Live with Bonnie Raitt and Nancy Griffith. Um, let's see here. Uh so my Richard Thompson marathon from last month got people very excited and everyone talked about seeing him live. So he's literally, um, you know, sponsoring this one just to please you guys. So isn't that amazing? So please give it up to uh, for JK for doing this. This is super interesting. And of course, for me, too. Um, so this is for them and for you, too. See, <laughs> I love it. These are all YouTube videos. Um, so they might have that. So a uh, Thank you so much. I did pull them up, um, waited for the ad the ads to go by. No biggie at all. Um, you know, we all know the YouTube game. Um, that's just how they work. And, uh, you know, that's no problem. So here is the first song. The first song is going to be a B-swing, actually a solo. Very interesting. Um, and also I finally get to see him. I mean, I saw him on the picture on Spotify, but not really in action. So and then... Se uh, second song is Dimming of the Day with Bonnie Raitt, uh, basically at a Bonnie Raitt concert. Third one is Wall of Death with Nancy Griffith. It says here, a beautiful Grammy-winning singer and songwriter who sadly died two years ago at age 68. Unfortunately. Um, uh, session on West f uh, 54th in 1997 and then that's number three then number four i feel so good on david letterman 1991 yay the year alexa was born and then uh, the fourth uh, i'm sorry the last song number five persuasion this is an austin uh, austin city limits so i'm i'm literally ready to go i got my glasses on got my bavarian shirt on eh? you see this is the evolution basically you end up being a bavarian you know, <laughs> I just had to get it. Um, so I don't know if I'm going to get some flack for it, but uh, I love it. I love this shirt. And um, so uh, give me just one second. I'm going to pull this up right here in front of you guys. We're going to select here. B swing. And give me one second. I got this. Uh-huh, and we're going to... The good thing is I do have two monitors. I should have three monitors um, for it, you know, to be more easy to pull up. But here, but here we go. Wasn't that, wasn't that nice? So here we go. So you guys can see better. And then I'm going to sit here on this side. Here is the video. So let's start it off. Thank you so much again, JK. This is going to be awesome. I have him here full screen. You have him right, sorry, on this side. So here we go with the uh, first song. Thank you so, so much. Here we go. I was 19 when I came to town. They called it the summer of love. They were burning babies, burning flags, the hawks against the dove. I took a job in the steaming down on Cauldron Street. I fell in love with a laundry girl who was working next to me. Well, she was a rare thing, fine as a bee's wing. So fine a breath of wind might blow her away. She was a lost child, but she was running wild. She said, as long as there's no price on love, I'd stay. Very nice. And you wouldn't want me any other way. Mm. 
brown hair zigzagged around her face And a look of half surprise Like a fox caught in the headlights There was animal in her eyes She said, young man, oh, can't you see I'm not the factory kind If you don't take me out of here I'll surely lose my mind But she was a rare thing Fine as a bee's wing that I might crush her where she lay She was a lost child But she was running wild She said as long as there's no price on love I'll stay And she wouldn't want me any other way Beautiful. We busked around the market towns, we pick fruit down in Kent. We could tinkle lamps and put some knives wherever we went. And I said that we might settle down, get a few acres dark, buy a fun and in the heart from babies on. Oh man, you foolish man It surely sounds like hell You might be lord of half the world You're not on me as well Well, she was a rare thing Fine as a bee's away So fine a breath of wind might blow her away She was a lost child As she was running wild She said as long as there's no price on love I'd stay Camping down the gower one time The work was pretty good She thought we shouldn't wait for the first And I thought maybe we should We was drinking more in those days The tempers reached the pitch And like a fool I let her run With the rambling itch Oh, the last I heard She's sleeping rough Back on the derby beat White horse in her hip pocket And a wolf hound at her feet And they say she even married once A man named Romany Brown But even a gypsy caravan Was too much settling down And they say her flower is faded now Hard weather and hard food Maybe that's just in the price you pay for the chains you refuse. Oh, she was a rare thing, fine as a bee's wing. And I miss her more than ever words could say. If I could just taste all of her wildness now, if I could hold her in my arms today, but I wouldn't want her. Wow, beautiful, freaking beautiful. I loved it so much. Um, give me just one, one quick second here. All right, I'm back. Now, what I loved, like, what I especially loved about this song was, of course, the lyrics, the, um, um, you know, about this woman, and, uh, but also, like, the, 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 the old, you know, it, so it sounded like an, like a folk tale, you know, like an Irish folk tale. He had, like, a little bit of that that whole singing going on and also the melody and i love that style i'm going to try and uh, show you a little bit here i have the, uh, already bonnie pulled up but i'm going to make it smaller and grab the guitar and try that finger style and it just like it's just such a cool thing to do um you know to play finger style on guitar i don't i i didn't really learn the chords because he had a capo on but let's try it um, so, for example, you know.
that's so beautiful uh, th uh, that you know this uh with the right hand it's the, the, this move There you go. See, so classical guitar is just so useful um, to to write um, beautiful melodies and sing at the same time. So I, I hope you enjoyed that little demo there. Um, I did not plan on doing this, of course, but there you go. All right. So, um, but yeah, Richard Thompson, what I love about him is that he is as well versed on the electric guitar as he is on the acoustic and he's a fantastic singer and that just gives you such a great tool set because yes there's guitar players who are very gifted on the lead guitar but if you also have to be good on the rhythm guitar and your classical game has to be up there so that's what, when you get players like uh, you know, Jimmy Page, because, I mean, look at the intro of Stairway to Heaven. I know it's not his, you know, as some people have uh, told me. I think Tarkas came up with the melody, but it doesn't really matter. But the whole thing in the end is a masterpiece. And I think it's just really, really important that you're, you know, know your chords. And e even if you're a lead guitar player um or a metal guitar player you should always focus and have an acoustic guitar to to fall back to okay so here we go um let's pull this up bonnie Raitt and richard thompson together on stage in deutsche um no this is i don't know something but i know this is a german program uh wdr uh welt deutsche i don't know <laughs> I, um, but I, I've heard some people talk about this. But here we go. I'm uh, super excited. This was such a great tune. Let's continue. <laughs> great honor to be able to sing this Richard Thompson song with the man who wrote it. Wow. He's so I love him. Gone, you hold me sway. 
listen to this. That's amazing, you know, when two mu great musicians come together, magic happens. I mean, her voice is so magical, and the way he was harmonizing with her was just, oh my god. And also their distinctive guitar uh, to um, tones, because I think she was playing a electroacoustic but with steel strings and I've I'm not sure but it sounded like nylon it sounded more like this you know um steel strings sound of course a lot clearer but these sound warmer just so so I think he was using nylon strings I'm not sure but I I, I um this was just beautiful dimming of the day oh my <laughs> word i'm gonna send this one to alexia i would love to do this with her like to learn it and uh, if she could do of course bonnie's voice and i could try and do richard's this would that would be a cool thing um but i have to she's not ready yet to play these chords i think or maybe you know i mean after a couple of weeks or months we could make it happen. That was amazing. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much for this. This was an amazing track. I loved it. Um, let's pull up the next one. All righty then. And here we have Nancy Griffith and Richard Thompson, Wall of Death in 97. So, I mean, you know, people unfortunately do pass away, but it, it's kind of sad when you are going to watch someone for the first time and you already know that he's not no longer on this earth but well you know that's just how it works and uh that's just how it goes so here we go with nancy and richard and uh 
Let's see if I can hold back the tears this time. <laughs> Let's go. Well, we'd like to bring up a very, very special guest. We just finished recording a second volume to uh, Other Voices, Other Rooms. It won't be out until June of 1998, but it's called Other Voices 2, T-O-O, -O, A Trip Back to Bountiful. Please welcome to the stage a man who is in himself his own category and genre of music. <laughs> Mr. Richard Thompson. <laughs> yes, you got that right. I love it how how, how loved uh, Richard is among musicians. This is so cool. Um, I mean, that was quite the compliment. He's his own genre, and uh, that's so cool. His own, like, that's so cool. I love it. It's a song that Richard wrote, and uh, <laughs> it will be on the new Other Voices record as well, and it's uh, always been one of my favorites of his, and it's called Wall of Death. Check out how hard it is for Nancy to keep up with because I think Richard is just singing it normally and the, the normal tuning and she's like an octave higher. So she's like, on the wall of death, da 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 You know, it's very, very hard to just, first of all, to find that key, of course, and then be comfortable in it. But just listen to Nancy here. Try, and she's looking over to him like, you know, um, I mean, she's a pro, but this is very, very difficult. Like, listen to this. Oh, 
<laughs> she was adorable. I love her. Um, oh man, she's just a beautiful person. But um, she was like, let me, let, I can't even do it. Let, let, because he was, let me take my chances on the wall of death, you know. And she was like, let, let, let I can't go that high. So um, that was very, very cool. I loved it. And what a great tune. And um, I'm ready for the next one. <laughs> here we go. Um, let me just like. Uh, I got him right here. Um, this is on Letterman. Uh, man, I do miss Letterman. He was a funny guy. He's still a funny guy. He's still doing um, stuff. Like, he has, like, the super long ZZ Top beard now. And he's just a cool dude. Um, okay. Here we go. Let's pull it up. Here we got David and Richard Thompson. I loved also the Steely Dan... Um, one where he was like, okay, I'm going to go over there and say hello to Donald and, and Walter. <laughs> so cool. Oh, my God. I mean, the people he he met in his life is ridiculous. Who hasn't he met? There's not one artist he hasn't spoken to. Okay, here we go. Uh, the album is called Rumor and Sigh. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome uh, Richard Thompson. Uh, Richard... <laughs> The bass player, I love it. And I, I'm so sorry because I thought I love her. Um, the bass player is obviously a guy now that it's a little bit blurry, you know. 
but hey this is amazing stuff i love it 30 years ago um insane okay pulling up the next one um sometimes it does work here that i can just like disappear the screen but i'll put it together one more all righty then and this is the last one this is persuasion um uh, richard thompson band and i'm i just checked something because I, it looks like the volume is very low i do apologize about that it is youtube though my um you know it's literally full volume everything is on full volume it's just that youtube is a bit lower especially these older videos but hey um i hope you are having a beautiful listening experience such as i am and i hope the mic is not too loud maybe let's go a little bit further back but uh, so far, man, this has been a riot, wonderful, beautiful uh, performances by Mr. Thompson and uh, Nancy and Bonnie and everyone involved. So um, um, also the band, really cool band. I, I love that also um, uh, David David's uh, famous pianist. I mean, he has been there, f I think, forever. He is always involved and he's also very funny and he always participates, you know, when they play. And I think when Steely Dan played, he was like, he can't really do anything because he's the pianist. Uh, so I guess Donald was like, yeah, you're not going to play my chords tonight. <laughs> you know, I don't know. I mean, he can, I'm sure he can. Yeah, I'm sure he's an amazing, accomplished musician, but... Donald would never give up his seat for somebody else, you know. So I guess when it's a keyboard player and then then he has to kind of like sit it up. But I, I, I did notice that the rhythm section was over like jamming with the Dan. Okay, so here we go. Um, Persuasion, Richard Thompson. <laughs> louder this is a song i wrote with um a very fine chap from new zealand um but you can't name me six new, Ze new zealanders <laughs> tim finn very good well that's who i wrote the song with very good <laughs> i didn't write it with russell crowe <laughs> that's what you're thinking oh he sings doesn't he? he's got a band and everything hasn't he i didn't know that check him out see if he's any good russell crowe and uh this song's called persuasion Oh. Tempted by the promise of a different life Time has fled There's a constant battle running through my head And I don't know what to do Cause I still believe After all the foolish things you put me through Make a start of something new. I've always been a man who's open to persuasion. Blind romance. There'll be no half measures given half a chance. We never love Just in the fire Where the cruel flame burns And we need to repair What was never there What got left behind After all the foolish things We've been through I can always make a start on Open to 
vision It's written in my heart So that everybody can see This was a real treat because, like, literally, JK, the first time, um, oh, Lord, it's not going down. <laughs> I'm like, okay, go down. No. Um, the first time I reacted to Richard Thompson, it was more electric guitar. It was more, um, solos and more, like, you know, this was more an acoustic set, and I loved that. And I'm going to also, of course, put that in the description, you know, the acoustic side of Richard Thompson, beautiful side, you know, um, I love his playing, I love his writing, you know, this is more about his compositions, his singing, not so much about the lead guitar, and I compared him a lot with Mark Knopfler, because, and I know he's been around longer, so, um, uh, but it's, it's just like, I, f I found those two styles so similar, you know, the way they play the blues, and, um, but what an, phenomenal what a phenomenal guitar player i love um you know electric guitar plays when they when they drop the electric guitar and you know uh, you know take out the capo i have a capo right here oh wait it's over there but um i since i don't sing that much i don't have to tune you know i don't have to place it anywhere because maybe his voice is also very low and that's why I mean, you just put it wherever you are more the most comfortable um, on the guitar. So when you sing, so um, I guess that's why he also didn't use it um, when he was singing with Nancy because it then he gets too high, you know. But uh, beautiful set. It's just a wonderful, um, uh, a wonderful musician. Give me just one moment and then I'll do the outro. All right. Well, it's not letting me minimize it. It's right there still. Um, it's not letting me minimize the screen. Um, you know, this computer sometimes that does what it wants, but it's all good. Um, this was fantastic. Thanks again so much, JK, for choosing these different songs. Way, way different. Um, not so, you know, it wasn't such a rock and roll um, marathon. It was more an acoustic one, and I do... I appreciate that very, very much. Thank you so, so much for sponsoring this video. And this was a lot of fun. Um, I hope everybody enjoys. Please, if you like the channel, if you like the reactions, please do subscribe to the channel. It's like a, still like 70% that watch the channel are not even subscribed. So we, we would love to see 
how far we can get. We just hit 72,000 subscribers yesterday. So thank you so much for that, everyone who is subscribed. I know most of the people who leave comments are subscribed, of course, but there's a lot of people that just, you know, watch one video and they never watch us again, which is understandable. You know, not everybody's into these reactions and or the music that we cover, you know. So um, there's a lot of young people and they're into other things and that's understandable. But I mean, if you do like the channel, if you enjoy these videos, please like and subscribe. The subscription is free. Um, there is a paid um, uh, tier as well, which is the Patreon tier where, where we do all the full albums. So far, we have over 32 full albums. I don't know if it's 40. Um, I could be wrong. I could be it could be less, maybe 32 or 34 um, right now is what we got. And that, that I mean, that would take you like just days to watch anyways. So um, but yeah, um, so thank you again so much for all your love, for your comments, for the good vibes and um, for the patience, of course, because we do sometimes leave and leave you guys for three, four weeks. So thank you for that. Thank you for sticking with us. So uh, without further ado, um, again, thank you so much, JK, for all your support, for all the requests, um, you know, I've gotten from you. You are <laughs> amazing. Thank you so much. Um, uh, thanks, everyone. I'll see you in the next video.